while we were away in the seventh frame. John Hersina left the baby split and missed it. It's a one pin match as he threw a pretty good shot on the left hand lane left the solid 10 pin. Hersina throws hard and straight at these spares and it just sailed by the three pin. Got to hit the three pin in order to make that spare. Next time you use the pinwheel and it'll show him how to do it. Nice stroke. Oh, why was that a pretty shot in a solid 10? I mean to tell you, this game will drive you to drink. Six pin just wrapped around the 10, but it never touched it. In closer to the third arrow, circling it out. Six pin whistles around the 10. He's made several of these before, missed one, but he has this one. So what we have then is a three frame match. One pin the difference, her Senna has it. So now it's a sprint to the finish line. Exactly. Good news is Gene Stuss gets to finish on the left-hand lane. That is good news. By her Senna's choice. Well, he must have liked the right-hand lane. Must have thought he did. <laughs> <laughs> I really like that. <laughs> Once in a while, you get fooled, right? Yes, definitely. I've been fooled so many times in my career. That's I'll why you, you can come up with that one. A false sense of security, as it were. And just when you think you got a lane, it up and grabs you just like, like that. that. Well, I said Gene Stuss was going to pay for missing that one pin spare but as it stands right now he's still liable to slip out of this match and get to the title uh, you just don't win throwing back to back splits on that lane and then getting eight out well, fast ball, ball for her center that ball must hook in the middle of the lane at that we've seen three quality players miss that four pin on the left I think the one shot that uh, we did see of the oil pattern down there in the last uh, five feet of the lane really gave us a, a very good description of what happens to that oil pattern. Here. Right. Let's see if we can. Well, it's hard to see with all the pins in the glare. Oil's moving all the time. That's what makes this such a tough game. And you toss one in there that you think's a strike, and you leave a 10. Yeah, leave the soft 10. And he's just uh, buried himself. He has buried himself. You can see there the, the worn path right there all the way how far that oil gets carried down the lane. It affects the back end, what the players call the back end. And they lose that back end. And when you lose the back end, you lose carry. In other words, the, the amount of hook in the last 15 feet begins to vary with every shot. And gets less and less. And uh, so the ball just doesn't hit hard. Gene Stuss in an excellent position to try and win his third title of the year and be the only player to do so. Boy, that was a quality shot. Same hit that Hersena had, but he snapped that weak 10 out, puts himself up 24 pins in a commanding position. Watch the six pin. See, that didn't hit as high in the pocket as the last one, but yet it snapped the 10 out of it. That, and that indicates when you see that, that heavy roll, which usually means good, solid fingers in the ball. Trying to finish off the job. And he's doing so nicely. Did you see that smooth stroke that time? I mean, he went up there with so much confidence on that shot. If he if he double pinnacles or something there, uh, that never even entered his mind. The only thing entering his mind was just, I've got this match, I'm going to put him away, and he did. So the two tallest and strongest of the players in the field probably this week, Gene Stuss and Robert Gibbs, will match up for the title. Well, I don't know. I, you know Arm wrestling match, I take John Hersena against almost anybody. <laughs> he's not as tall. Though. No, he's not as tall, but when he the comes point to I was making. <laughs> I know one thing, he could bench press me without any problem. Yeah, probably the two of us together. Yeah. Really a fine performance, other than the miss of the four pin. He got lucky. Hersena went right up and opened after he missed that. Yeah. And sometimes that's what you need, a little bit of luck. 
you don't win match game competitions by opening after your opponent's open. You win them by stomping on him and striking. <laughs> now a little more room. Yeah, of course. Persina hits the pocket, but it's too late. Gene Stuss trying to become the only three-time winner on the PBA Senior Tour, but Robert Gibbs is trying to stand in his way. 